Derek, how pleased were you with the performance this afternoon? Yeah, very, very. Thought it was a great game, thought it was a great advert for the Women's Rugby League. We stayed in the grind, Leeds really tested us, uh, so yeah, I thought I was, I was really impressed with us. A much closer game than the grand final last season, is that what your team needed just to show you that you can be challenged this year? I think it's important, I'm not sure about needed, uh, but I think it's important that the games are like that, you know, because it's a challenge for everybody and it's enjoyable. You know, enjoyable games are not where people are being nailed or being, you know, battered. So, yeah, I think it was a good game. Some good tries from, from both teams. Uh, Every party is going to get plenty of headlines thanks to her two tries on the wing as well. But how, yeah. how much of that was hard work by Amy Hardcastle? We shut down really much in that first half. Yeah, Amy's always a threat, you know, a strength. And, and I think they picked a team to defend us. Um, I thought they had some changes and I thought they handled Amy quite well. But, you know, Amy's a, you know, an old timer, if you like, and I'm sure she won't mind me saying that. And she's experienced. So she comes up with that one play, then that nudges us ahead that, you know, gives us the ascendancy really. So, I mean, Ebony Parsons, a young girl, she's been with us for since the start, but, you know, she's getting a, a chance now and she's worked really hard. So they talk about all the, the, the players that we have, but Ebony's an up and coming star in her own right. You lost Carrie Roberts midway through the second half, but the team didn't seem to miss her much as the game went on. No, and I think that's the good thing about our team. We've got plenty of resilience and, and you know people can play in uh, different positions and we don't miss a heartbeat and I think that's the importance of having that strength in depth. You, obviously a lot of attention goes to the half-backs from, from Leeds today but Zoe Harris played another another great game for, for St Helens. Yeah Zoe has been a really underrated player and I think now she's getting the accolades that she deserves you know she's obviously rugby league player of the month and I think she deserves that and she's a great great kid and great person to work with as well Zoe. I think I asked the same question on, on Tuesday. Now you've won again, how do you keep going on to, to go on to more glory? I think it's something that the, the, the girls want. It's a culture that we've created within ourselves. You know, we've tasted disappointment and we know how that feels. So now we, we, we want to be on the big stage. You know, in, in games like today, there's only room for one team. It's not it's not a game for, you know, two teams. So on days like today, we want to make sure we're winning.